Scientific notation. Scientific notation is a mathematical expression used to represent a decimal number between 1 and 10 multiplied by 10 so you can write large or small numbers using less digits. So let's look at going from ordinary numbers to scientific notation. If we have 75,200 and we want to write that in scientific notation, we need to move the decimal point so that it's in between the first and second significant digit. So in this case, our decimal point starts out here and we want to move it one, two, three, four places. So in scientific notation then we would say 7.52 times 10 to the 1, 2, 3, 4. What that really means then is we're taking 7.52 and multiplying it by 10 four times. Now the number the way it was originally written has three significant digits, so when we write the number in scientific notation, we want to make sure we still have three significant digits. Now let's look at point zero, three, five, zero. If we want to write that in scientific notation, again, we're going to have to move that decimal so that it's in between the first and second significant digit. So we're going to need to move it one, two places to the right. Now point zero, three, five, zero has three significant digits. So when we write it in scientific notation, we have to put that point three, 3.50 times 10 to the 1, 2, negative 2. That means we're taking 3.50 and dividing it by 10 two times. Now let's go from scientific notation back to ordinary numbers. If we have 2.50 times 10 to the minus 3, and we want to write that in ordinary numbers, we look at the exponent. It tells us we want to move the decimal three places, and we want to move it to make a smaller number, so we're moving the decimal towards the left. So we've got one, two, three places. We're going to have to put in placeholder zeros. So we're going to have point zero zero two, five, zero, when we write that number in ordinary uh, numbers. And let's say we've got 5.01 times 10 to the 5. We look at the exponent, it tells us how many places we want to move the decimal, which in this case is we want to move the decimal 5 places, and we're going to move it to make a bigger number, so this time we want to move it to the right. Well, we can move it two places, but then we have to add in placeholder zeros to fill in the rest of our spaces. So we've got 5, 0, 1, and we're going to have to add in three decimal places to hold, three zeros to hold our decimal place. So our number would be 501,000 with two significant digits.